Uh, hey Boogie, I uh, just wanted to let you know how my World Wipe pre-release went. Uh, I'm going to show you some cards that I got, and pretty much the order I remember getting them in. Yeah, okay, here we go. So the first card that I pulled was Arid Mesa, the fetch land. I already have one of these, and I wasn't really planning on doing a landfall deck. At least, I, I mean, I didn't, anyways, I didn't get the cards for the landfall deck, but, so I was kind of disappointed to get a fetch land. I mean, I know they're 10 bucks cards, but I didn't sell them back, so. Uh, the other card I got was another fetch land, another I got a Scalding Tarn. I was not thrilled to get two fetch lands in a row, I was hoping for some big creatures or something. Um, but. I was happy to get a red and blue non-basic land. I don't have very many of those. Then I pulled Predatory Urge, which uh, basically is an enchantment that lets my creatures get in fights with other creatures. But, I mean, I I'm not really a fan of that. I'll just attack if I want to do that. So I didn't use that. Um, the next one was one that I was actually hoping to get, which was pretty cool. The Basilisk Collar. Um, it's an equipment card that gives Death Touch and Life Link. And it only costs one, which is good. And I actually did use this one in my deck, and I drew it a couple times, and I got to use it, and it worked out really good. It was, uh, it was nice. Um, and then my big creature that I got, actually got one, I got one big creature, was uh, Mordant Dragon, cost six, he's a 5-5 five, five flyer with some um, expensive fire breathing. Um, when he comes into play, he deals some damage. And so that was cool, I threw him in the deck, I was hoping to draw into him, but unfortunately didn't draw him the whole freaking day. Not even once, didn't even get him in my hand. So, so much for that. And then I got a World Wake Dual Land, Man Land. And that was pretty cool because uh, you can pump him up. So I'd turn him into a 2 2 and maybe like pump him for 2 or 3 and point for 5. So that was kind of useful. I mean, it was also kind of nice. One, one game I actually used the Basilisk Collar on the Man Land. So it was pretty good to have a pump up a bold Death Touch Life Link. That was, that was probably the best card combo I did the whole day. Um, so I made a red black aggro deck, but it didn't it didn't work because uh, for some reason I ended up with the wrong ratio of lands and it, it just sucked. But uh, I did win a couple promo cards, um, but I didn't win any packs or anything. I got one win, one tie, because I played this like nine year old kid that took forever on his turn. And then two losses. Uh, so, not the greatest. I mean, it was cool to get some cards, but it, like I said, I didn't do very good at the pre release. Uh, just wanted to say hi. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'm a new fan of your videos. I'm subscribed. So, I'm looking forward to see what else you're putting out.